Pinkies! Welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Matindi Jacobs. Thank you very much for joining me for another video. In today's video, we're doing it a little bit different. I'm not recording from home, as you can see. Today, I'm recording from Caribou Studio, and I'm so excited to introduce this new business to you. Caribou Studio, if you follow me on Instagram, is a sister company to Caribou Flowers, the flower shop that makes these beautiful flowers. So we started this uh, Caribou Studio in response to people who want to take pictures for their families, portraits, uh, product shoes. This is the place that you can come to. We hire out the space with its furniture, with its decor, with all of its implements for $450 per, per an hour. And you can come here with your photographer and take pictures and lifestyle content and everything that you'd want to do in this space. So we're really excited to be launching that with this video today. And I hope you guys take some time to get all the information that you need in the description box below. So today's video is all about home decor accessories that I've been loving. My husband and I recently traveled to Cape Town and were able to pick up some beautiful home decor accessories from h and I'm going to be walking you guys through some of the items that I got there right here. I'm going to show you how I style them and I'm going to show you how my place is going to be very, very gorgeous this summer. And I'm looking forward to engaging you guys in the comments as usual. Without any further ado, let's get into the video and I'll start by showing you the first item from this h and haul. Let's go. So the first item I want to show you, Rafiki's, are these cushion covers. So Asian M Home is my go-to place for cushion covers. Very good quality and very reasonably priced. These two cushion covers, and these are 60, 50 by 50 centimeters. These two cushion covers were $150. Can you imagine? For two cushion covers, you can see the material, the fabric on here is really steady. It's a nice linen blend. And I love these, number one, because of the color, the pattern. It's not something that you're going to find in your shops here. And also just the, 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 the size of it, 50 by 50 is a really good size cushion cover. And I'm able to change my cushions in and out during the winters and during the summer times. And these are something that I always make sure to pick up. So next time you're in H&M, please make sure to pick up some cushion covers. You won't regret it. And they also wash out very, very well. The second item I want to show you guys, probably one of my favorite purchases is this. This is a beautiful candle. So I didn't know it was a candle. I initially thought it was a vessel, but it's this beautifully scented candle. And unfortunately, it broke over here. It's a three-week candle. But what I love about this is that after the candle wax has finished, I'm going to use this as a, as a container. I'm going to use this as a beautiful ornament to place on the table. It's a deco ornament. I can also use it as a jewelry box. I love that it's so multi-purpose. And this was 299 I love the texture of this, very wabi-sabi. If you've noticed, I'm really pro uh, slowly but surely changing my style to more wabi-sabi, to more organic shapes and, and, and textures and colors. And for me, it really relaxes me. And I feel like it's very luxurious without the ostentatiousness of, you know, the glamour look and all that. So wabi-sabi, organic is definitely my vibe. And this is something that I'm going to hang on to for the longest time. The third item I want to show you guys is comes in a set, these two. Okay, so these, like again, uh, the wabi-sabi shapes. Wabi-sabi basically talks about uh, imperfection, you know, so taking pride and uh, uh, taking pride in the imperfection, in just organic lines and, and shapes and all that. And I love this for that. So this is just this beautiful vase, this beautiful texture you can see there. I love the color. And this is just something that you're going to style on a shelf, on a coffee table, on a book stand, and they come in too. So this came in this, in this set, and they were really reasonably, reasonably priced as well. I don't think I paid more than $500 for both of these two. So this is like a little footed dish. I can put whatever I want in here. I can use it as a catch-all bowl. I can use this as a vase alongside it, and I'm going to display this on my shelf. And I'm going to show you guys towards the end of the video or with inserts in between just how I'm going to style these items. But I love the color. And the thing about Age and Home is that you don't find stuff you typically find in our Mr. Price homes, in our um, at homes. You find very different, just unique pieces, and that's what I love about that. So really, really, really happy that I stumbled upon these. The next item I want to show that also, again, with the wabi-sabi flair, is this jug. This is just a milk jug, juice jug, whatever it is that I'd want to use it for. It's this beautiful handmade. You can also see the beautiful texture on there beautiful color and I got two of these these are 349 and it's just something when I'm serving breakfast I'm gonna pour our tea our juice for example in here or the milk and I just like that it's 
uh, nice and steady nice and uh, I love the color I love the shape and it's just a nice addition to my to my kitchenware the next item I want to show you guys probably one of my favorite purchases and I've got three of these now uh, so this is a vase um, I had to pick this up again because it's so beautiful the shape it's something that you can put flowers in uh, it's waterproof you can you put flowers in you can leave it on its own and again you can see the movement of that you can see the texture this was six hundred dollars and I love these I bought three of these uh, it's something I have at my home already and I had to pick up more when we went this time again because it's just I just think it's a very functional item and the color is so beautiful and again that shape this is not something you're going to find just anywhere it's really beautiful and really 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 wabi sabi i'm gonna be saying wabi sabi a lot you guys please excuse me i'm just really in love with the design with the design style of wabi sabi so that's definitely my favorite purchase the next item that i wanted to share with you guys is this little uh what can i call this like a little statue so it's just this wave kind of thing uh, it comes on a little pedestal this was 399 and this I would definitely place on a, on a bookshelf, on a shelving unit, just a nice uh, deco element. I love the color. So you'll notice that the color scheme is really strong here. Uh, I've got the nudes, I've got the blacks, I've got the creams and the whites. So that's the color scheme. That's the colors that I'm going for. And for me, it just relaxes me. It's a nice neutral home. And for me, that's, that's luxury. That's what luxury means for me. You know, when I look at items that relax me and bring me a peace of mind and, you know, calmness, that's what luxury is for me. So, really excited about this too. Don't have anything like this in my collection. Love this brand. Uh, we've been collecting a lot of her pieces for the longest time. And when I was in Cape Town, I decided to pick up a set of these side plates in black. So, I've got the white collection and the black collection. But this one is not so easy to find. They do sell Carol Boys in a, maybe at Manrico. So if, you've got, if you're interested in Carol Boys, you can go have a look at what they have there. The black is not so common. Uh, so I was able to pick these up. These are beautiful porcelain dishes. Nice side plate. And you've got that face on there. So we've got the cups already. Uh, I also bought the dinner plates. And it's just something that I needed to add to my collection so that I've got the full collection. And I really, really love this. Carol Boys makes some amazing stuff. I'm a big fan good quality design and I also love that that they are dishwasher safe so I can pop this into the dishwasher when I'm not in the mood to wash dishes and this is what that looks like we also got the dinner plate let me just pull those here These are the dinner plates, and this is a set of four. I think we picked up two boxes. I usually like to buy sets of eight, uh, just in case two of them break, then I still have a full set of six. And these look like so. So you can see here on the box that you've got different faces on them. Love it. Just love how. That looks like I love the black. I love a black dish, especially when you're cooking something colorful. Put it on a black plate and you're good to go, even if you're serving something very basic, like carrots or whatever. The moment you put it on a black dish, it just pops it and it makes it look very luxe and very gourmet. So really excited to be serving my guests in these and I'm just really happy that I've now got a full set of Hero Boys in my kitchen. Last but not least, okay, there are actually two items left. The last, the second last item I want to show you guys, Rafikis, is this. These are little salt and pepper shakes. And this is so wabi sabi. Look at how cute that is. So you've got that little pepper shaker. And then this is your, which one is which? I think this is for the pepper and this is for the salt, if I'm not mistaken. But these are so cute. I love this. I'm going to use them on my kitchen counter just to add a little bit of playfulness. And last but not least, my last item from Asian Home is this dish. This is a 349 dish. So love the abstract shape of it. Uh, love the texture. Love the color. And this is something I would use in my bathroom maybe. Uh, I could put like a nice little hand towel in there. I can put my jewelry in there at the end of the day, for example. I could also use it for 
it's a jewelry holder like a catch-all dish you see how nice that looks like I could put it on my coffee table you know you can use it for so much but uh, I love this I just love how 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 elegant it looks and still wabi-sabi still imperfect but really beautifully made so this is the last item I purchased from H&M and that's really what I wanted to show you guys so I think that's the end of the haul. I now want to go uh, where I'm going to set up and give you guys a tour of Caribou Studio so that you guys can see how it looks like. I'm going to walk you through all the different vignettes that we've created in this room. I'll show you the inspiration. I'll show you where we bought some of the items. And hopefully you guys will be interested to book Caribou Studio for your next photo shoot, for your next family shoot, for your next product shoot. We'd be delighted to have you. So let's get into that. All right, Rufiki, so welcome to Caribou Studio. Come on in. So I want to start on this side, I'm going to show you what we've done in this area. This is the side of the wall as you come in. We've got this bookshelf, uh, what used to be a bookshelf, and we've just taken the opportunity to style it with all of our favorite, my favorite at least, all of my favorite decorative items. Uh, if you know me, you know I love vases and ornaments and all these little thingies. So this is really a place where I get to display all of the things I've been collecting over the years. Some of the items on here are for sale. Some of them not, <laughs> but you're free to walk into the uh, Caribou studio to inquire about something that interests you. And so at the top, uh, I've got all these items here. I've got this little Zen lady over here in the lotus position. Uh, it just brings a very nice, calm energy into the area. We've got this um, Maita statue. I love these. Uh, these were all arranged a couple of years ago. So this is really nice for just styling on a bookcase on top of books really love that and then just it's in like bits and bobs everywhere and you'll see that the predominant color here is white I've got small touches of silver small touches of gold and it's really just a display of all of my favorite things you'll also see that I've tried to keep the heaviest stuff at the bottom uh, not so much actually not so much but I've tried to put different textures different shapes and I've tried to spread it around and at the top here we've got some gold ornaments, we've got some vases and the thing about Caribou Studio is that everything I'm going to show you in the studio is basically available to you when you rent out the studio. So you can use any of these items as props in your photo shoot, as styling ornaments, you can use anything that you have in here for that uh, at no extra cost. So the studio comes with everything, the furniture, the deco items, everything and everything else that we have in our shop you are allowed to use except of course the flowers if you want it fresh flowers those would be a separate bill but I like the fact that you can come around here and you can use the deco items to play around with different themes for your photo shoot and for your product shoots if you're having that so that's just how that looks like uh, I love the colors and it's really one of my favorite things on the shelf so please take some time to enjoy it The next area I want to show you guys is probably the area with the biggest furniture piece in this room. So this is the area where we normally position ourselves when we're taking photos. I'll insert a couple of photos that we did, uh, that we took from a family photo shoot that we had here. So this is our couch. This was supposed to be a kidney couch. Not exactly a kidney couch, but you get the idea. We wanted a little bit of a unique shape to fit nicely in this corner. And I love the curve of that. So this was made by a company called uh, wallflower interiors. I will put the information down in the description below. So I just sent her a picture of what it was that I wanted and then she was able to make it for me. She gave me the samples for the fabric and I made those and we've just basically adorned this couch um, with these gorgeous round pillows. Uh, I got these last year at the Decorex in South Africa from a company called Nova Luna and I love these. So we've got the smaller size and then we've got the bigger size and they're just so nice and playful. And these are beautiful styling moments. They are all the rage and they are made from this beautiful boucle material. 
and it's just a really nice styling element on an otherwise very boring or predictable couch so i like to use this on couches i like to use this on beds and i've been using them a lot in my projects recently uh, behind this couch we've got this beautiful um very photogenic uh, banana palm leaf tree. So I've had this for the longest time. I bought two of them. Uh, I think I bought this. It's as old as my daughter. I bought this three years ago. It was really, really small. Bought two of them. The other one didn't make it. And then this one I brought here to Caribou and it's just been thriving since. We had a little bit of some issues with it uh, beginning of the year. Uh, we had put it outside and it got sunburned. But the moment we brought it back inside, it just really lit up and it's been thriving ever since beautiful beautiful plant very sensitive you need to get someone who's really good with plants to take care of it and we've got michael here at caribou flowers who does that but it makes all the difference right this corner would have been, looked very basic otherwise if we didn't have this and it's a very photogenic plant and i really really love it it's definitely one of my favorite things in this room and i get a lot of questions about it we got this from ferreras garden and uh, they're readily available i think you can pick them up for between 400 and 600 dollars so this is that area and i just like to come sit here sometimes have a cup of tea if you follow me on instagram you'll see i post a lot of my reels from here and it's just a really nice area to sit down have a quiet moment, contemplate, and just feel nice and stylish while doing so. So this is that area. And the next item under this vignette is this ottoman that we are making use of as a coffee table. Uh, I wanted something small, something round, couldn't really find what I was looking for, so I settled on this. I actually had this in my walk-in closet, but it wasn't make, I wasn't using it. Uh, so it's got this nice fabric on top, and then we've got some nice gold hardware here at the bottom. And then we've just tied it with this dish that I just showed you guys, a beautiful Naka candle, and Naka candles are available at Caribou Flowers, beautiful home fragrances that are made, proudly made in Namibia. I'll put the information in the description box. And this this is basically how we start that area you can have your cup of tea resting on here when you're taking a break and I think it fits in beautifully with the rest of the design of this area and that's basically how we start that area I want to show you guys I'm going to stand up for this is here so this is um, the artwork we have in here we don't have any other artwork in here so I wanted something that would make a statement we've just got this line art I got this at Cory Croft at a bargain because the glass that was covering this the protected glass broke so I got it for a reasonable price I uh, also had this in my walk-in closet decided to make use of it here I thought it would be better fitted here and we've got this nice nude frame and then the picture is very simple it's a lady maybe two ladies you make up your mind what you want it to be and then we've got this beautiful wall sconce i get a lot of questions about this this is a wall sconce that i picked up from um amazon a couple of years ago and it's just a nice highlight and we're able to switch it on to just highlight this picture um to put some light on it when we want to and it's just a really nice vineyard i think it's very french it's beautiful it's minimalist but also very chic so this is that other area i've also taken some pictures from here before it's when you come and pose and you're like mm, mm, mm. so the next vignette we've styled is this tulip table i got this tulip table from nictis uh they come in white and they come in black i think uh, for the black one at home you'd have seen it if you follow my instagram i'm always posting about that so we've just styled this uh we style this occasionally depending on the theme of the photo shoot of the product shoot and today we've decided to start it with some black ornaments i've got this beautiful black vases that i thrifted and then the new one that i just showed you guys in the wall and again we've grouped them in groups of three and then i've got this beautiful preserved amaryllis over here that's just flowing out of this vessel just a nice textural element very stylish and we've just placed them on there and what i love about this is that you can come here you can sit down you can lean on it take a picture and it's a moment so we've tried to be very intentional when we style the studio to just make sure that we've got different vignettes 
all over the room. It's a small room, but we've got strong vignettes throughout the room that people can take pictures at. So you can take a picture here with these ornaments leaning on the table. You can take pictures over there. You can take a picture sitting on the couch. You can take picture by the mirrors. So the intention was really to make sure that you've got various opportunities, styled opportunities to take different pictures, but in a single room. So that was the thinking. And I think it came out great. And I just love how simple it is, but how chic it is. The wall paneling, I forgot to mention, is also definitely a feature that works really well in this room. The wall paneling we did on the top and then we did uh, um, in the middle of here just to separate the top and the bottom. And again, it just brings that French chicness to the room. And we got this done by Melo Interiors. Joe did this for us and I love the way it turns out. And it's definitely a highlight in this room. So the wall paneling, everybody yet in this room so we've got mirrors on either side of the wall and they are placed exactly the same place so we've got this mirror on this side and then on the other side at the same place we've got the same mirror and they are this beautiful oval shape nice gold and then we've placed the pedestal over here and this beautiful uh, bought vase over here. So we used to sell these vases two, three years ago. We got them from a South African company called Bod Vase. This is the last one and I've just taken a moment to celebrate the female form by placing it on a pedestal. So that's also something that you can do in your house. You get a pedestal made, something nice and high, and you place an ornament on there. It gives very museum vibes, it gives gallery vibes, and it's really just to celebrate the specific item that we've placed on there. I love that um, the area again you can kneel on here take a picture smile you know it's a moment we've created a, uh, another vignette in this room just to have someone take nice pictures if we want we can also take this uh, board dress off from here and place another ornament on there that we want to celebrate um, if we wanted to do a product shoot for example I've also taken pictures here for caribou flowers we've placed our flowers here and then we can take pictures of them so just again that intentionality when we designed this room I'm really proud of how this room came out for Fiki's. Uh, I love how luxurious and chic it looks like. Uh, I think we've taken some really, really uh, good items and utilized them in their best ways. And I think that uh, everyone who has come here so far has been happy with their outcomes. Uh, and like I mentioned, all the information is gonna be in the description box below. But yeah, just thank you very much. Thank you for taking time to watch this video. Uh, it's going to be a long video. I can imagine the editing that I need to do after this. But Thank you very much for taking time to watch this video. Please let's engage in the comment section below. Let me know if you'd be interested in coming to do a photo shoot here. Maybe we can do a giveaway. I think that would be a good one. Maybe we can do a giveaway and one of you can win a, a fully paid a photo shoot at Caribou Studio. Uh, let me know if that's something that you think we could do, that's something you'd be interested in. And I look forward to seeing you guys in the next video. Take care and mwah.